Hey guys, so today I'm going to do a massive, a massive haul for you. It's a collective haul, so I don't think I've just like gone out and spent hundreds of pounds because really I don't have that money. It's from January sales, it's from Christmas, it's from money I got from my aunties like all around the world for Christmas. So I just got um, a lot of stuff. So I'm just going to go through it all, I'm not really going to spend ages, otherwise this video will be absolutely so long, it'll be ridiculous. So I'm just going to start off with this top I got in Topshop. It is this lovely cropped black top from Topshop and it's got this Peter Pan collar and then all these, it's like little flowers which from a distance look like studs. Now I absolutely love this top. Thing is though, I wasn't really sure on the Peter Pan collar but it actually looks quite cute on. And that was in the sale and I think that was about £12 but I'll put everything in the down bar, all the prices and everything like that and where to get them from so if they're still there you can go and get them yourself. So that was the first thing I got. So moving on, this is going to be in a really random order by the way, nothing's going to be like sectioned off into clothes, makeup, just whatevs. So next up, I am a massive stud fan, throw a stud on anything, stud on a bin liner and I'll wear it. So I got these shoes from Zara, they're like cowboy boots for studs and they're to die for, I think they were like, they used to be about... 90 pounds or something and now these bad boys were 50. I know they're not that much off but look how beautiful they are and they just go with absolutely everything. You just can't go wrong with it and I saw actually if you can't afford these Primark do a pretty good copy. I saw it today whilst I was out shopping. They've got less studs, it's just a few studs up here but they were only 20 pounds so if you want to have an alternative go to Primark. And then I went shopping online for H&M um, and I got this really lovely bodycon, like what, how would you describe this pattern? I feel like it's what um, those type of patterns that psychologists use to say like what can you see here? I see a bird. This is the type of um, dress I think it is. I've always wanted this. Zara did a dress like this as well and it's just very flattering and beautiful and the back is like that with a kind of low um, back and oh price is not on here but it's a small. I got it all in a small so I thought that was really pretty and it's got a tiny bit of padding in the shoulders. I'm not really a fan of padding but it's really tiny so I'll get over it. So yeah that was from H&M. River Island, I went in the south and they always have massive sales but it's like a jumble sale of hell. It's like you have to mentally prepare yourself, go outside the store, be like, Rusa, let's focus. So I went in there like super early before work and found this top. I tried to get a couple of things from River Island that I could wear in the summer, funnily enough, and I found this great top. It's, don't you think it looks very All Saints? I feel like the design is very All Saints and All Saints tops are ridiculously expensive for what they are. But this was only £7, which is like a bargain central. I got it in a size 6, which as you can see is quite oversized in itself. And I would just pair that with some great like high waisted shorts or just throw it over skinny jeans with a thick chunky knit when it's winter as it is as it's going to snow on Sunday. But yeah, that's that. And from Urban Outfitters, I got, I've always wanted this top as well, it's the Run DMC top, like so, I think there was, this was really cheap, like £15, and before it was £32, and it's just really simple design, I like my tees which I can kind of layer up, so if it's hot, take off the layers, if it's cold then cardies, jackets, I just think it goes with anything, jeans, shorts, put some boots with it. So that's that from Urban Outfitters. The other top I got from River Island was another top that I'd wear in the summer because I want to go to Ibiza this year. So hopefully I can wear these tops. And I just fell in love with this top. I mean, how amazing is it? I went into, you'll find, like six River Islands to get this. And this is in a size medium, so a medium and it was £7 as well, it used to be £18 and can you just imagine that with some nice boots, with the boots I bought, the black Zara boots with this, 
some shorts in summer in Ibiza you cannot go wrong it was a bargain if you can be bothered to search through the River Island sales then definitely do it Get some bags in then should we do the massive Primark haul now Primark is another one of those places that you need to be in the right mindset to like investigate the whole store and yesterday was one of those days so first of all I bought this necklace for two pounds as you can see, it's this, oh, it's kind of gone round. Oh, it's gonna look great. Like, it's just very dangly. It's two chains in one. And I wanted to get loads of chains because if you if you have a lot of plain t-shirts or like wearing t-shirts, I think jewelry just makes it so you can throw anything on it and it kind of looks like a different top. So that was two pounds. Then I got this dress from Primark. Now everyone needs to go get this dress, obviously if you like it. It was £15 and it's this dip hem, like so, thank god I'm tall, dip hem dress and it's white and it's got this like lace, not lace, like this flowery detail on the front of it and it's got these like really cute pearly buttons. Sorry, it's gone really dark. Pearly buttons and elasticated waist. So I got it in a size size 10 for 15 pounds. And that's still a little bit roomy, but what I will say is it's quite short, but then I'm five foot ten, so maybe it's because I'm a giant. <laughs> so that's that. Very, very lovely. I'm excited to wear that. And it will go really nice with that gold chain I just showed you. Then I'm really into my bodycon dresses at the moment. And I got this really, really simple, long sleeve, extra long, it's like this really soft material as you can see, it's quite, I don't know how to, oh, it's just super soft and super gorgeous, and it's got these long sleeves, three quarters actually, and it's just really simple and I would just jazz it up with accessories, a nice jacket and some boots, and you're good to go, it's just gorgeous. Next up from Primark. Oh my god, I was umming and ahhing about this. But it's just fabulous. And in the summer on holiday, oh, look at it. It's a body. And it's from Primark. Oh, all the tassels are messed up. What is that hanging out? Here we go. So it's a body and it's got this fringing at the front, like so. And it's this beautiful coral colour. And it just buttons up under the crotch and I thought this would just be fabulous like on a night out you could definitely wear it and then on holiday what better outfit could you have than this body and I think it came with a grey um, tassels as well I got this in a size 8 and it was £7 so a bargain but have, has anyone else noticed that Primark is actually getting sneakily more expensive and the quality isn't getting any better like I feel like if you're going to up the price, at least have a seam that doesn't go like that across the dress. Next up, I got this necklace from Primark, which was £4. And it's got these kind of bullet silver and gold shapes on them. Really bad at describing things, I've just realised from this. It's got skulls on it and crosses. And let me just show you. See, it'd be really, really nice. And again, it's two chains in one. So that was lovely, four pounds. I'm a bit of a gym freak, so Primark has started, just released a um, sportswear, and they've brought out these cool socks. They're just trainer socks, but like fluorescent colors on them. And they're only two pounds. How can you go wrong with like three pairs of socks for two pounds? So that was really cool. I got these piece earrings for £1.50. Oh, I just think they'll be lovely. Especially because I've got really long hair. I, just, I like the way big earrings look when you've got long hair. So they were, again, £1.50. And then, which is one of my favourite buys from Primark, I got these trio of necklaces for £2. So you've got a cross. Um, a Diamante skull. I'm not really a fan of Diamantes, but it's not that bad. And then this kind of tribal triangle. And I would wear them all together. I'd just pair them. They seem quite long, as you can tell from the back, they've just pinned them. So 
they're quite long necklaces so that will be cool and uh, next up I got this bag oh, I loved it it's so cute it was only 19 pounds it's really small so it'd be great for the festivals that are coming up I keep forgetting where this is from Pull and Bear which is one of my favorite shops in London I think it's so affordable I don't know if it where else it is but it's so affordable and it's just a small bag to fit your essentials in you can just throw in your camera throw in some makeup your purse and you're really good to go it's got this long strap I'm obsessed with bags with long straps I hate holding it under here and I get like arm ache and my muscles like have to be popping out to hold it up but I thought it was cute anyway and I just came back shopping and I really shouldn't have. You know when you've got like your shopping devil on one shoulder being like, buy it, buy it. And I was just like, oh, but I just thought to myself, I just won't buy lunch out for a couple of weeks from work, which will then balance it out, right? Does anyone else like justify spending in their heads? <laughs> anyway, I got this long maxi tube skirt from River Island and it's got this slit down the side and I just thought it was absolutely adorable and I could just pair it with some pumps or some bands it was £20 I got it in a size 10 and then I got this lovely top from River Island oh wait did I say it's £20 well it was £20 this is, I got this oversized in a size 14 and it was £22 and it's just a really simple white top and it's got like this kind of tear kind of effect all over it and at the back it's got this crisscross and I just thought it was really cute. I got it oversized because it just came up a little bit tight and I thought it was cute to oversize and I can really pair it with this, just tuck it in and have some converse for a really comfy day. And then, I'm coming to the end, you'll be happy to know, I've got this top from Topshop in the sale and I just thought it was really lovely. If you don't like um, wearing dresses on nights out, you could just pair this with some wet look leggings or some black skinny jeans, but look how gorgeous it is. It's like this zigzag sequin, it's not on the back as well, which I like because I think it would be a bit of an overkill. But I just thought it would be really cute. Yes, I thought it was nice, and this was, I'm probably just going to make it up, but I thought it was about £20, I could be wrong, sorry, it doesn't even have like anything in it, and I haven't even worn it yet. But that's that, all for the clothes, and just the last thing I got today, because I'm obsessed with nail polish, nail art, anything to do with nails, thrown my way, and now, nail polish is so expensive recently, I'm... I was gonna get an SE one and $7.99 I was like I'd rather buy some clothes because I'm clothes obsessed so I went to Miss Sporty and I actually really like the nail polishes they've got such a great range of colours first of all I got this amazing pink colour and they were only $1.99 each you can't go wrong with $1.99 and this great like mermaidy metallic -y green and finally, again, another, like a deeper mermaidy, bluey, like scaly type of colour. I just thought they'd look great. So I'm going to put them on my nails tonight. Not Obviously not all of them. This one I think I'm going to put on tonight. And yeah, that is about it. I know it was really, really long. But like, I hope you liked this video. If you did, then definitely give it a thumbs up and subscribe because I'm going to be putting up videos really regularly about twice a week and I'm naming this day Fashion Friday where I'm going to do hauls on a Friday if not a haul, just something I buy on a Friday and show you how I style it which I thought would be quite cool for you guys even if it's from just a piece of jewellery how I'd style that with an outfit or if I buy something like a dress how I'd style it so watch out for Fashion Fridays I'm really excited about that and yeah I hope you guys have a nice day Mwah!